It seems my time has come to use a mage build in Terraria. I was planning on relating this to the highly successful Scooby-Doo Wizard episode, but sadly its fame is sure to get a copyright claimed. So instead I'll be using the underrated hidden gem of magical fiction, the Harry Potter and the series. Some of you might say, oh it's the Harry Potter series, but no, and the is in every title, therefore it's the Harry Potter and the series. <laughs> Philosopher's Stone. Oh, I already have that item. Chamber of Secrets. In Harry Potter, there are four clans. The goodies, the baddies, and the forgottens. The leader of the baddies hit a creature inside the school that kills anyone born to the wrong family, which is very topical right now, so I'm not gonna talk about it. To become a wizard, first we need a wand and a spell book, and I'll be going for the rainbow rod and golden shower, two items I'd spend more time talking about if I wasn't trying to keep this channel PG. The wand is pretty easy, just have to kill some unicorns and pixies. Then you can craft it. Oh my god, what was that sound? I got an achievement. Imagine that happening whenever you did something good. Buttered bread without ribs, didn't send you two to the waiter, ate three vegetables in one month. Don't judge me for my low expectations. Now I have my rainbow wad. The spell book, however, can only be found in a crimson world. Now that I'm in a new world, I need to kill the wall of flesh again to get into hard mode, which means it's speed run time. Mind down, avoid lava, resist rewatching Velocipasta for the sixth time today, reach hell, sacrifice the guide, kill the wall of flesh with your overpowered items. See, this is a pro strat called bunny hopping, and, and right there I used the bottle to wrong walk. And I, I won't show you this, but I'm using a second controller with my feet to reduce the captures. Wait, I died? Well, I'm, I mean, I, I prefer to take games slowly and enjoy them anyway. After a while, I went to the Underground Crimson and fought some flying squid monsters, which, I don't know, it's probably in Harry Potter. This wiki has like a million pages, I'm not gonna read it. Hello, Albus. Could I please have a spell book? Is your thing, Tom. I, I got a new spell that I, someone's bagged wine. No, no, I need a spell to conquer evil. Well, I, all right, then I'm fine. A bit of a ways, but uh, after that traumatic experience, I'm ready to venture on. Uh, where is the chamber, though? I know where, kid. You must hunt down the slime basilisk in the land of light. Only you have the power to win. But why me? Because you're a main character, Harry. Don't know who he's talking to, but I found the basilisk. My new powerful spell should be able to defeat it. Oh yeah? Well, I've got a slime myself. It's not the size that matters, it's how you use it. And that, kid, is why you always put on sunscreen. Oh, it dropped something. Gelatinous pillion. I have a weird feeling that if I rearrange the letters, I'll find a secret message. And it spells out... No. Stop. Never mind then. Although, it did drop this note. Regards from Lord Voldem- <coughs> Voldem- uh, uh, It seems I can't pronounce it. I guess I shall not name him? Harry's uncle is in prison. For, well, they say murder, but really it's for lying about his height online. I mean, look at that, he's added an extra half an inch. And today, we're gonna break him out, performing the greatest heist this world has ever seen. You might be wondering why I'm using game footage instead of the movies. No, it's not for copyright. How many books do you see here? Seven. And how many movies? Eight. Therefore, they are obviously different series that have nothing to do with each other. First, we need some better armor, which would be a lot harder if we didn't have a 2D view of the world. Now, was the dungeon in Terraria made to directly represent the prison of Azkaban? Yes, absolutely. If I bend the truth enough, yes. Since Plantera was defeated, it's got a lot more populated and scary in here. And these dungeon spirits are the Dementors guarding everything. You might think Dementors are supposed to be dark and gloomy. No, you still haven't got that the movies are unrelated. Dementors feed on positive thoughts. They are happy, glowing creatures. So we just focus on negative thoughts will be safe. Shrek Forever After didn't win an Oscar. People care more about pineapple on pizza than actual wars or anything really. Companies adopt pride flags for one month just to sell more product. Uh, where is this guy? I've been looking for- wait, who's that? Get back here! Come on, I need a golden shout! Wait, his name- <laughs> His name is Bo- Bone Lee. Like- like Bruce Lee? But he's a skeleton. <laughs> And he's like jump kick. Oh my gosh, how'd they come up with that? After a while of that, I managed to craft the Spectre armor. Now I drain life from others and rescued the internet fraud. There's also a whole time travel side plot, but I'm not gonna touch that because I don't write myself into corners, you morons. <laughs> Goblet of Fire, the undeniable best in the series. Seriously, this thing is amazing, so I'm not gonna spoil any of it. <laughs> Order of the Phoenix. The story starts with Harry finding a Dementor to save his brother, and then he gets expelled from school for using magic outside, like giving your kid a smartphone and then getting angry when they swat the neighbour. If you don't want people to misbehave, don't let them behave at all. We then meet up with Harry's strange uncle, and Lupin. He looks, uh, trustworthy. Oh my god, look how many emotes are in this game. That's more emotions than I'm capable of in real life. 
Yeah, Lupin's a werewolf. I could have guessed that. Some of you might be saying, this is all in the wrong order. Lupin was a werewolf back in book three. Yeah, well, less than 5% of you actually read the books, and I'm counting on you being drowned out by everyone else who blindly believes me. Either way, I want this power of werewolf turning, and to get it, I need to kill another werewolf, which means waiting until night. In Terraria, you can rest in a bed to speed up time, which is really good because it gives you time to reflect on your life choices. Should I have invested all my money in Bitcoin? Is it bad that it was spelt with a Y? I really shouldn't have sold my hollow Charizards for it. Ooh, night time. I think I should go visit my angler after all this time. He loves the ocean, that man. Wait, where is he? I guess he's on vacation. That's like... I drowned? I have the power of flight and can summon sentient life through my starves. And I died to some polar V-shaped 104.5 degree HOH molecule. That will be on the test. Oh, and I got the moon charm, so now I can turn into a werewolf. Plantaro gave me a key to go to the jungle temple, a place which holds the most powerful enemy in the universe. Second most. Apparently the temple has a guard that only accepts those he deems worthy. And this time, I'm not going to use my skill in combat. I'm going to seduce him. It's time for a makeover. So I looked up what men want, and it just came up with a bunch of pictures of this dude, so I don't know what to do. I just went with something that vaguely looks female, and we'll see what happens. <gasps> it's you, Mr. Skellington. Well, wait until you see me without this hood on. May I enter? Eh, yeah, nothing. He has a will of steel. What if I... Yep, he's a fairy, I knew it. Okay, maybe I'm not ready for this place yet. I need a new book to base my power-ups on. So to end this one, the uncle died because he couldn't- Dodge! Half-Blood Prince. So this book is all about Snape, someone I probably should have introduced before now. But just know he's been this teacher who's always been kind and helpful to the main characters, overall a lovely human. Snape, I need more power to defeat the Dark Lord. Ah yes, I know of a potion that will help you very much. You must find me a giant blue mushroom, rotten teeth, some gunpowder, purple slime, and green flame. I have it all, what can we do with it? Oh, thank you. Now we can make something called methamphetamine. I haven't heard of that potion before. Shut up, it's just for my clarity of mind. If you want power, go get the Deathly Hallows. Ah, Snape, what a helpful jelly fellow. Oh, more wiki reading, how exciting. Wait, these books took 10 years to write for only 7 of them? And it's the highest grossing book series of all time. Next video coming out in 14 months, guys. <laughs> Deathly Hallows. The first Deathly Hallow is the Resurrection Stone. Now some of you might be saying, No, no, that's not the first one. The first- Shh, I'm changing the story to fit my video structure and I don't accept any criticism on it. Like I said, the first is the Resurrection Stone. It brings people back to life. But I'm playing a video game, so I already have that power. After much research that I don't feel like explaining, I decided that it was the Bat Scepter in Terraria. And to get it, I just need to do the Halloween event. Just go to sleep until the start of next night. I, I sold my car for more Biet coin. What am I doing? The Halloween event has me fight an assortment of spooky characters like Hellhounds, Scarecrows, and Morning Wood. A name I'd spend more time on if I wasn't trying to keep this channel PG. The boss of it all is <laughs> Pumpkin. Get, get it? Because it's like Pumpkin, but he's the king. And now I have a staff that shoots bats at people. Next, I move on to the second Deathly Hallow, a powerful wand. Yeah, no, I'm just going to do what the wizard should have been doing the whole time and get a gun. Oi, Dumbledore, where can I get a gun? Where is he? Has he passed out on Goon again? Oh, Snake killed him. What? It I'm sure he has a good reason. Yes, I was jealous that he could grow a beard. Ah, <laughs> good old Snape. Keep doing you, man. He also told me that there's a gun in the dungeon that could help me. And I can get to the dungeon a lot faster now that I have a tree to ride on from the Halloween event, because humans only have two legs and trees have a... Uh, seven, I think? I don't know, I skipped a lot of score to watch Harry Potter. So we're going back to the dungeon. Guess who we're gonna see? <laughs> Bo Bone Lee. I, I should just quit making videos. I'm never gonna make a joke that good. I found the rainbow gun. Two out of three down. What is that? Oh, that is a huge Dementor. The third Deathly Hallow is the Cloak of Invisibility. And in Terraria, there's Shroomite armor. Turns you invisible. But I need hundreds of mushrooms to make it. And I have a weird feeling Snape would know where those sorts of things are. He does! His helpfulness knows no bounds. I'm also supposed to destroy the Horcruxes, but I don't want to. Because I'd have to introduce more characters and my current impersonations are bad enough. Now I have the armor. So when I stop moving, I should be transparent. Brilliant. Time to enter the Dark Lord's temple and face him. Then I will be the most powerful wizard in the land. To prepare for the boss fight, I'll need one more magical item. The Rod of Discord gives the ability to teleport. And in the magical world, you need a license to use it. Have you ever killed anyone? Or sacrificed the guide? Uh, have you got ambitions to take over the world? Then I will be the most powerful wizard in the land. Uh, Is your mental state at all compromised by substances? Methamphetamine. Uh, Do I look handsome? Yes.
I got my license. Time to go into, what, wait, Shrima, I'm a socks for majors. Snape lied to me. It turns out Snape was a bad dude the whole time. What a twist. Back with my Spectre armor and every item to make my build strong. I'm ready to face Gollum in master mode. All my training led up to this. This is for all the characters I never mentioned. Which is only like three. I got most of the storyline, I think. Don't bring a giant robotic fist to a magical gunfight. I lied. I never liked the fourth trick. <laughs> Ooh, I look pretty in this one. <gasps> but that one. And he's dead. I've won. And you might be saying, that isn't Voldemort. He has a nose. And you're right. In Harry Potter, there are four clans. I'm also supposed to destroy the Horcruxes, but I don't want to. It's your thing, Tom. I never told you which clan I was in. I am Lord Voldemort, leader of the baddies. Or as we prefer to be called, Snake Gang. <laughs>